Hey friends, how is everyone today? You're gonna have to bear with me because this is my first time hosting a stream in what, like six months? Um, yeah, it's been a while. It's been a while. Um, spot the critter. Um, and also, you know, I just thought, I don't know, I thought today might be nice to stream something a bit witchy, something a bit magical, something a bit fun. And also, raise some money uh, for the wonderful UK trans community, because they deserve it. And because we could all use a little bit of extra magic in our lives right now, hmm? Anyway, that out of the way, how are you all? I hope you're all very well. Um, I hope that my sound's all coming through okay, everything's all right, hi everyone. Um, if I sound a bit funny, by the way, so I came back to work last week, immediately, immediately get COVID. So I'm on the tail end of it now. Um, big up to Ian and Zoe. It's like, I come back, I'm like, peace out. I'm gonna go be sick for a while. I couldn't be sick for a while. Obviously I have a six month old, that doesn't happen. But yeah, so let's play the game. I'm not, I don't know much about this at all, I have to say, so I'm very excited. Do love, do love a wee, oh, there's a fa there's a button for fashion, already obsessed. So let's get in here. Let me, I'm just checking to see, to make sure that everything's okay with the audio and everything. Sound is good, thank you Jonas, thank you Nightcat. Okay, there's a button for fashion, so let's just, a fl flashy top. Apparently, everyone tells me, having an, a nice top, it's back in. You know, not since, wow. Whoa, I am feeling all of these options. <gasps> oh my God. Living, living witchy cottage core fantasies right now. Funnily enough, I've been re-watching, uh, re-re-watching all of Buffy recently. Cause you know, when you're nap trapped, there's not a lot else to do. And uh, I've literally just gotten to, um, to, Oz's departure, and I'm at Hush now, which, as everyone knows, is Tara's introduction. So I'm very excited about that. Jumpsuit, shorts, these are all excellent. Western outfit. Ro oh, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. Okay. Red dress. Oh, there's a cape. Oh my, how are we supposed to choose? You can tell that the, 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 the developers are, they, they know their fashion. I will take suggestions, but right now, right now I'm, I'm feeling the ruffles. <laughs> Dragon Bother, warm fashion only, it's back in freezing here. It is a wee bit, yeah. It is a wee bit. Um, oh, Tara does rule, Santo. And Oliver Morgan, so thankful that you all care about and support trans people. Obviously, of course we do. I mean, I, I'm sorry that that, that support can't be can't be, you know, taken for granted. It should be in more places, but we will do what we can. Um, no ads. <gasps> oh, Bo, Celestial. <gasps> Flower crown, Daisy June. I mean, oh, it's so cute. It's all so cute. How do, right, we need to make it match though. Um, I'm liking the, oh, that's cute. I'm feeling some kind of, some type of way about crowns and mini flowers. Dunno. Get cape where cape thrives, says <laughs> Jackie Bobbins. Yes, absolutely. How pen dragon vibes? Yes! You are absolutely right. Um, Fedonite. Uh, that's, do you know what? I knew I was, I knew I recognized it from somewhere, and I reckon you're at. Where is it? 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 Oh my god. Shall we? Shall we cosplay as, as Hyle? I mean, actually, there's a few, there's a few nods to Hyle, isn't there, with that, and the, kind of that, too, a little bit, just more fashion. Oh, my gosh. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. Scalloped frames. Well, I'm not wearing my glasses at the moment, but, um, maybe no frames for now. Earring, Yes. Although, we could go full on Celestial. 
know, actually, you know what? I think the, the little flowers match better. Um, <laughs> more, uh, body yaddy yaddy. <gasps> oh my gosh, there's so many options. Tattoos, freckles, so cute. Body hair, cute. Moles, cute. Can barely see them, but they're there. I can see. Um, what do we think? Um, I'll read some some super chats. Well, Codex vs. the World member for 13 months. Uh, press button do fashion. The best button ever. Well, right after the like and subscribe buttons. Am I right? I'll show myself. I know you are 100% right. Absolutely. Alex Mars says, I dig the square frames. Uh, Samantha, Samantha MB says, I want that crochet vest for me, though. I know. Um, uh, Badger Fudge says, Ruffles is good, but I'm a sucker for a cape, personally. Mm. <laughs> Tim the Monk. Yeah, an English person. I know, right? Flyer crown says Snow White Rose. Oh, this is tough though. I think everyone wants the cape, so I will, I will acquiesce. I will go for. Um, I think. I mean, I I do love a cape moment as well. So like, where is it? Fashion. Oh, there's no wrong. That's there's no wrong option. There isn't. Um. Right. And then also. Uh, Lafayre, Lafayre Rue says, I uh, wish I could stay, but I'm at work. Catch the vod. No worries at all. You, you pop in when, when sit you. Um, and, uh, Dodger5277 uh, says, uh, Z fan, her brood say welcome back. Oh, Maggie Denim and de toi and now Rachel. <laughs> I love the name some people give their animals, honestly. It's so good. Get cape, wear cape, bye. Of course, Lloyd Maeve. <gasps> That's been my fashion journey, at least. I mean, you know, I think, I think I speak for all of us when I say same. Um, also, we're 10% of our target already, by the way. Uh, the Just Giving link is pinned uh, in chat. Um, if you, if you're able to, no pressure whatsoever. Um, but just thought it would be nice to support a charity today. Um, it was a little bit limited on the charities that we, that we were able to support. Um, Obviously, YouTube's built-in function only supports American charities, and I felt it was important to support a UK charity today, just because reasons. Um, and gendered intelligence wasn't on there, um, but I thought Mermaids was a was a was a good choice as well. Um, and we have some messages. Uh, thank you so much, uh, uh, Bish Bosch, for your donation, anonymous as well. Snow White Rose, thank you. Uh, so glad to donate to such a magical cause. Let's smash this. Um, Dave H says for a fantastic cause. Uh, Timo Kramer says thank you for doing this fundraiser. Um, Silver Song says, love what you do, Aoife. keep up the good work and fuck the Tories. <laughs> uh, Brandon Dara says, welcome back, Eva, for your first solo stream. Great cause, happy to support the mermaids. Amazing. Steve Clark, thank you. Xenogil, 180, every little bit helps. You're absolutely right there. Uh, Georgina Wheeler, trans rights or human rights? You're absolutely right there. Anonymous, Anonymous, and Helen, thank you. Magic Chris Isles, thank you so much. Space Hopper Copter, thank you. Wow. EA122, trans, trans rights or human rights, keep up the great work. Team EG and the EG community. Thank you so much. Uh, Matthew Austin, Anonymous, Shane, James is all the best. Um, Sinead Bracken, thank you. Anonymous, Roy Boy. Jonathan Rice says, can always trust your gamer to be a beacon of inclusivity and a positive voice in gaming. We we will always try. Uh, Scott, thank you. And Lloyd Maeve says, as ever, thanks as ever for showing what a supportive and loving community team you're a gamer are and for making another day on Turf Island a little more bearable. Well, the community is amazing and I will always say that. Um, but yeah, I just felt, I just, it, it's hard enough to be looking on right now and seeing some not so nice stuff. So I felt like, you know, our wonderful trans community, just maybe a little pick me up was in order. Maybe it would be nice to see that there are, there are lots of wonderful people here, um, ready and willing to support you. Um, and we will, we will amplify the love today we were try we'll try our best uh, jtoy64 says um just wanted to thank everyone for being super awesome and getting everyone through tough times sending good vibes and could use some in return please Ugh. all the good vibes cape vibes i mean what more do you want cape see cape positivity um and uh I think that brings us up to date. Yes, so sorry, we've been looking at the game a real long time. We haven't even started the game yet, but I just wanted to say, just wanted to, to, to send the love. Lips, yes, lips. <gasps> oh yes, full lips, blush three. Cute, 
No, I like the little lines. No freckles. Freckles. No. Dimple? No dimple. Dimple? No dimple. Glitter! <gasps> oh my god. It's like they know. Um, features, fashion, face. Peg seat. So cute. <gasps> so cute. Oh my god, I love all of these. I don't even want to mess with it too much. This is so cute. Um, lots and lots of options. <gasps> cute! Oh, gorgy. Gorgy, gorgy, gorgy. Peach boy. Oh, Should we just stick with the pexy? I'm kind of liking the pexy. And then... Let's maybe go for some witchy, witchy eyes as well. There we go. Okay, I promise we'll, we'll play the game now. Play the game now, right? Okay. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Well, what? Oh, whoa. What are we going to call ourselves? Please, I need help. I don't know, everyone. Um, I, I think uh, let's keep the, let's keep they, them. Why not? Uh, let's, uh, let's shout out our, our NB siblings. And, uh, yeah. So it's, so it's player name Von Teasel. If that helps you decide on a name at all. Um, and the hardest choice of all, the name, says Mr. Ambinder. I know. Uh, well, you should be, it should be butts, really. Heil, though, might be fun. Might be a bit on, on brand. I swear I had those shoes at one point. And I want them again. Don't know what happened to them. Um, ooh, Aether is nice. Butts, more butts. Tiffany, okay. Is the fundraiser going to be open after the stream? Uh, says no genius, can't give anything until next week. Yes, I'm going to leave it open um, at least for a week because... There's no rush on this, um, and thank you so much for checking. Um, that's really kind of you. Um, let's see. Diesel Von Teasel says Jupiter Mont. <laughs> Tyler. Uh, Wild. Kestrel. Ooh. Kestrel. Taran. Butts, butts, butts. Serena. Rowan. Tassel. Tassel Von Teasel, though. Mistress, don't disrespect. <laughs> Max, because EG never do the minimum. <laughs> This is too oh, this is too hard. Taco Von Teasel though. Viva Don Viva Von Teasel. Tassels. Tassels is good. Tassels might be it. Tassels Von Teasel. Oh, I like it. Okay, let's do it, because otherwise we'll be here forever, right? You mean we aren't gonna spend the whole stream in the character creator? I know. Hey, listen, if we don't if we don't move through this fast, we may well. Alright, done. It's done. <gasps> Welcome to Flora. I'm very excited about this. Zoe says this has been on her uh, on her want most wanted list for a while, so I hope she doesn't mind we're jumping in. My name is Tassels Von Teasel. Let me just boost that audio a little bit. Is that is that okay? I am 18 years old and I have a crow familiar named Ramsey. <gasps> All I want in life is a crow familiar. Because I already have a cat. I dislike listening to my gran and people and drama. Fair. I like my familiar Ramsey and witchcraft and being me. Oh. Yeah. Everyone in my family thinks I'm hopeless. Oh. Which is why they sent me here. To the village of Flora. To prove I'm worthy of having the Von Teasel family name. Oh. I'm sensing some generational trauma that we're gonna have to work hard to undo. But at least we love ourselves already, so you know, that's fine. Just a non-caffeinated beverage, sorry. Mm-mm. Or, you know, whatever. <laughs> Wait, I forgot to be non-committal. Oh, I just, well, I just spilled a non-caffeinated beverage on my keyboard, that's a good start, thank you. Um, honestly, I wasn't listening all that much when my grand told me. Well, okay. <gasps> it's so cute. Well, I think this is it. <gasps> oh my god. I just I just think they're neat. All Corvids. Yeah, the village is pretty small. Do people actually live here? Listen. I grew up in Ireland. There's some pretty small place. You can live in you can live pretty much anywhere. We need to go to the town hall, right? Grand said something about that. I want to know who did this voice. Who did the voice of Ramsey? I must know. Whatever. It was their... 
Well, I guess it was Grand's choice to send me here. The rest of my family just wanted to say, oh, no. Either way, I'm here, aren't I? Isn't that enough? When they could have just... What experiment? Just... Hey, you do your own thing. But no! So I acted out a little. They deserved it! What did you do? What did you do, Tassels? And don't tell me you didn't think it was a little funny. I think it's kinda sad. Rap, rap. I need to get my frustrations out somehow. No, Tassels. That's not how you hold an... an... a... a fame? A thame? A thame? Why don't you wear the traditional Von Teasel garb? Is that... that's not what we're looking at right now, then. A Von Teasel shouldn't speak like that. Are you sure they're really a Von Teasel? Hmm. <gasps> yeah, let's not... Oh. He's like, let's not dwell on the past. Let's not make ourselves feel bad. Let's move it on up. Yeah, I know it's better not to give them any mind. They're not paying your bills. Pay them bitches no mind. Yeah, I know it's better not to give them. And they're not here to say things. Uh, but they're still going to judge me at the end of it all. Yes, but you know, rent free and all that. Don't let them. Sure, let's head to the town hall. The mayor's supposed to be expecting us or whatever, right? I'm sensing some apathy that we need to get rid of. Ooh. Ooh. I guess that's the mayor. Oh, but that's all so cute. So freaking cute. Um, let's see. All right, we've got some messages. Massages. Let me see here. Um, we have one from... Uh, Nayland Blake, uh, thank you. Uh, Super Chat, it doesn't say anything, but thank you. West Coast Weaver, member for 17 months, is as someone with a weird and positive relationship with crows, I would just like to say thanks for the trans support to wake up to. Of course. Um, and then let's see how we're getting on with the... We were at 10%. Uh, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> I just refreshed the page and we're at 49% we're at of the goal? What just happened? Literally, what just happened? <laughs> what? We've only been streaming for 18 minutes, everyone. Anonymous, uh, <laughs> thank you, Ken says FJKR. I don't know what that means. I've, uh, suddenly, I can't read somehow. Um, Anonymous says, just because I miss Chief and also giving feels good. It does feel good. Thank you. Chris Sturm, thank you, Anonymous. Thank you. Steph Eats Dice says, we support trans rights, but also trans wrongs. Be gay, do crime. Thanks for supporting these wonderful causes. Sending love to the community. We absolutely... I support all of the wrongs. I want to see all of the wrongins. Um, Liz, thank you. Nayland Blake says, every trans person deserves support, life, and joy. Thank you, you're a gamer. You are absolutely right. David Brown, great to see you back here for this is a great cause. XGA95, Kevin Welch, WhoMD, thank you so much. Uh, trans women are women, trans men are men, trans rights are human rights, and fuck turfs. I could not have said it better myself. Although, I'm, as you can tell, I'm trying to project love and positivity. So I'm letting you guys say everything else for me. But I am in total agreement. Thank you so much. Uh, Nat Doig says, thank you, Eurogamer, for being so inclusive as always. This is wild, you guys. Uh, Ava Wobbles, such a delight to wake up and see this stream was happening. Thanks for the little bit of brightness. Wes Wolf, trans rights are human rights. Fuck terps. Uh, Foo Flies, forever supporter of trans rights. Anonymous, thank you so much. Becca, thank you. Beth Thompson, love to all trans and NB people and allies. We are with you. Yes, that I mean, that is. this is so beautiful to see because I hope it does serve as a reminder that we are we are with you. Kit Farmer says trans rights. Uh, Alice Allen, Hafrin, amazing. <laughs> I just refreshed this page and it's like, pardon? Ex I beg your pardon, excuse me. Wowee. Uh, Chucklefish, uh, Heath and your gamer crew just wanted to drop by, send some love, and tell you how amazing you all are. Really very cool to see mermaids being championed and hope the stream goes well. That's awesome. Um, wowee. Uh, Corvus Albright, yay! Uh, Aoife Stream Haiku for Aoife Stream Haiku. Awaited return. Glad to see you back on stream. Repping the Corvids. Always. Wowee. That is incredible. Uh, some guy sitting down and says, uh, Hey, I missed you so much, Aoife. I'm so happy you're back. Well, I am happy to be back, even if I am a little bit covety. But, hey, you know. 
All right, I guess we should go to the town hall. It, it probably won't let us go anywhere else. I cannot, sorry. I'm just like, what? As if we got to 50% already? Anyway, I'm gonna have to up that target soon. If you aren't careful, don't threaten me with a good time. I think this is it. Ka ka. No, you knock. Ka ka. You don't have hands? Hmm. Use your beak. Hello. I'm Ruth, Mayor of Flora. Can I help you? The Mayor. I'm Tassels Von Teasel. Tassels? Yes. Von Teasel? Yes. Is Margie with you? Margie? Marjoram Von Teasel. Is that going to be our man or something? Oh, of course, Gran. Nope. I see. Will Marjoram be joining you later? No. I see. <laughs> I see. Okay. Well. Good. Good conversation, you guys. <laughs> um, Marjoram said you'd be expecting us. Well, we were expecting a Von Teasel. Ruth, I'm sensing an attitude here. But truth be told, we were expecting... Ah! The letter. Oh, that's right. My grand said to give this to you. I'm sensing that Ramsay is the brains of this operation. Really? Thank God Ramsay is here to keep it all together. I see. I asked Margie if she could help us with our harvest festival during a critical time. And Margie sends me her grandchild who needs to prove they are worthy of training. Great. Opportunity. What? What's the problem? <sighs> Ruth, was it? Are you okay? Oh, I'm sorry. Pardon me. I lost focus there for a little. I just should have expected something like this, is all. Alright, Ruth! I guess I'll just leave, shall I? You've got this all in hand, I assume. Just a little. But you do know what you're do- I mean, who knows really what they're doing? I mean, it's good to be truthful. And that's where the fun begins. Then tell me, tassels, was it? Why do you need to prove you're worthy of training? Shouldn't you be finishing your train? Ruth, I have had it, but I have had it up to here with, uh, with your judgment. Yeah, I don't actually fit into the confines of, um, of esta like establishment learning. Um... Really? Let's say, throwing things together and seeing what happens, yeah. I see. Mm, yes, mm, yes. Magazine? What magazine? Coffin Politan. <laughs> Tell me it's online only, because otherwise that magazine's gonna be hitting some tough times. Uh. Do you know? Just your luck. It's all a big joke, really. No harm it was really intended. Though I guess the... <sighs> I mean... Ah! How far? Avon Elsa. <laughs> oh god. So it's not like readers knew it was a Von Teasel witch. Of course, of course. Shenanigans. I wouldn't know the meaning of the name. And did your grandmother explain what you'd be doing here in Flora? Helping out with the festival or something, yeah? Kind of, only half listened. The Floralia Festival in two weeks. Two weeks? Yeah, sure. It's getting smaller and smaller, and this year is looking to follow the same pattern. No, that's why I reached out to Marjoram. I feel like all our energies are just off somehow. I was hoping she'd help us with our festival, but you got me. In you got me instead. Perhaps this task means Marjoram trusts you. Probably, or Marjoram was busy. Yeah. <sighs> Yes, please. That's enough of your negativity, Ruth. Hello. Ooh. Come in. Mel, the outfit is everything. 
everything. Hello. Oh, Mel's the magazine fan. The ardent reader. <laughs> you look so young. Yeah, aren't we like 19 or something? Oh, because she thought they were their grandfather, grandmother. Uh, Mel is my second in command. She's been a big help coordinating everything for the festival these past years. Yep, yep. And this year is going to be the best. I just remembered I have a meeting to go to. If I run, I should still make it on time. Bye. Lead the way. Ooh, options, options. Attractive people everywhere. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Kind of. Well, I guess this is a shop. Do we have any? Well, I'd hope so. Somehow I always forget about this store. <laughs> Where do you get your stuff? How do you how do you live, Ruth? I don't I don't think you're being entirely truthful. Oh. Yes. Tomorrow. Yes. Attractive person. Oh, the art studio. Nisha should be around here somewhere. Oh, what the heck? Now I've got to clean up your mess again. Nisha, is everything okay? <gasps> They're an artist. Uh, I just accidentally knocked over some paints is all. Huh. <laughs> Two weeks. That's plenty of time to get in a little bit of romance, to be honest. Uh, weren't, ex weren't we expecting someone a lot older? Yes, a lot less attractive, but here I am. What are you gonna do? Tassels is my friend's grandchild and a witch in training. Don't we need a witch out of training? <laughs> It'll be fine. Tassels is a Von Teasel after all. Mm hmm. Well, we should continue with our introductions. Bye! I get the feeling she doesn't like us very much. Who, Nisha or Ruth? Because Ruth, I mean, yeah. But Nisha was just doing her thing. Uh, just from this little thumbnail, looks a little chatty. But let's let's see. You walk into the town square. It's in a state of disarray. This is where we hold the Floralia Festival. Nice fountain. I know it looks a little chaotic, but it'll come together. I'm sure. Jonas can be pretty dependable. Can be. Jonas? <laughs> Jonas! Are you around? Just walking around the town square. Hey, Ruth. Whoa, is that a crow? Did you befriend it or something? I don't see my familiar. Ah! <laughs> Tassels is a witch. Oh. Oh. Uh-oh. Our usual builder injured himself the other week, so Jonas is taking over in his place. Yep, tomorrow is my first full day in charge. Good, I think everything should be in tip-top shape by the festival. Well, we'll be on our way. So Jonas is scared of us. Uh, yeah. Or is up to something. Got our eye on you, Jonas. Uh... No, let's uh, let's check in on our messages. Uh, Corvus Albright, member for 18 months. Uh, early departure haiku for early departure haiku time. Ad admin work to do, stupid capitalism. Catch you on the flip. Thanks, Corvus. Um, Jess Kenny, welcome to Magnificent Members. I haven't installed the button yet. I forgot. And I haven't, I've got all the things, My but my stream deck isn't equipped for it yet. So instead, imagine confetti. Pew, pew. New member, yeah. Ah. Yes, yeah. Um, <laughs> Ruth's sauce. Uh, Leah, uh, S uh, Sam Adeni, uh, welcome to Magnificent Members again. Pew, pew, yay, Leah. Welcome, welcome, confetti. Um, and, um, let's, shall we check in on the... Uh, Auric Merciless says, this reminds me of Boyfriend Dungeon. Uh, did you ever go back and finish that? I didn't, know. I didn't get time to, but I really do want to, because it was a lot of fun. Um... Oh, uh, GB says, I think she likes you too much and is putting up a false front. That is possible. We're on 62% of our target. That is incredible. We're on over 3,000 pounds already. That is amazing. Phil MC3 says, thanks for supporting a great cause and for everything you do. James Thompson says, 
Uh, f fuck JKR and turfs. I I don't I I I forgot how to read somehow. Uh, Joseph Kungar says trans rights. Uh, fuck turfs. Uh, Clarice Ember Eye says trans rights are human rights. Glad to be part of the light we all want to see in the world. So grateful to see a loving and positive stream focused on inclusivity. Absolutely. Rory Wilson, thank you so much. No relation. Um, MJ Animus says, trans rights are human rights, wonderful cause, and I love this channel. Keep up the great work. Well, thank you. Raquel says, first time in my life I'm well enough mentally and financially to help others. Thanks for everything you do. Oh, well, Raquel, thank you so, so much. That is really, really appreciated. Um, again, there's absolutely no pressure to donate um, to anyone, um, but if you are able to, you feel comfortable enough to do so, it is very much appreciated. But, you know, just being here supporting is, is wonderful, just as wonderful. Um, Sydney Wren, thank you so much. Chose says, as a trans person myself, thank you for being so wonderful people. Um, lots of love to you, Chose. Um, Anonymous, thank you. Lemzy, thank you so much. Avery, Anonymous, Sarah, John Michael Jarvis. Uh, Aaron, Aaron Demel says, so, so happy you're back, wonderfully fit, and thank you for supporting such a wonderful cause. All the love to our trans siblings. Agreed. Amazing. Born to Poodle. I love that name. <laughs> trans rights are human rights. Corvus Albright, thank you so much. Support all the trans friends. Smokey Zeus 5, thank you so, so much. Uh, Weaver, thank you. The Dark Star, thank you so much for doing this. Eva, love to this community and glad to contribute to such a worthy cause. Much love to our trans sibs. Thank you to um, Anonymous, Anonymous, Gwenifer, um Wow. Incredible stuff, guys. It's just amazing. Like, I don't know why I'm still surprised every time. I'm like, oh my god, you guys are so... Ch of course you are. But, you know, just know that it's appreciated every single time. And it's just it's spreading a little magic today of all days. Um, it is pretty pretty wonderful. Zachary Nelson uh, says, got the day off in this amazing stream supporting such an amazing cause. Couldn't ask for a better day. Lots of love. Um... Wow, that is so, I just, I'm seeing so, so many lovely messages and I want to sit and read them all, but we do need to, <laughs> we do need to play the game too, but that is wonderful and I hope that, um, I hope, hope, hope that um, if you are, you know, uh, part of the trans and MB community and you, you've been having, especially in the UK and you've been having a rough old time, I hope this brings a little smile to your face, um, knowing that we're all here to support you and I think you're very wonderful and you know it's it's not all terrible even though it's hard sometimes for sure you approach a cafe let's see if Jean Jean is around hello mayor a chef so we've got an artist a builder a chef oh we're just stopping by this is tassels the witch helping us out for the festival hmm Hmm. Hmm. Have you met Mel yet? Yes. Hmm. Oh, okay. Jean, 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 Ma and Mel are married. I mean, um, oh, that's nice. <laughs> were we, were we shading? Were we shading because Jean is punching maybe a little bit? Or are we sh shading the... I don't know. I don't know what we're shading. Well, we'll be on our way. Just wanted to give a quick introduction. Goodbye. All right. Mmm. Can do. Oh, I want a treat. All right. And then one more. What do we think their occupation is? They have a beret on, but artist is already taken. I'm going to say... Author? Poet? Something like that? This is my home. That is if anyone is here. <laughs> Riff, did you just leave your house today? And we're like, well, hope nobody robs me or moves in while I'm gone. You should really know who's in your house at any given time, Ruth. I mean, even if you don't have a ring doorbell, I just feel like that's something you should be on top of. I don't know. Ah, musician. I knew they were artistic. Saw the beret. Devin. Devin, can you come here a moment? Oh, I'm sure, Ruth. <gasps> Aww, they're so cute. They look like they're playing a bard in a renaissance fair. Wow, this person looks uncomfortable. Maybe we came here at a bad time. Devin, this is Tassels. Hello. Ah, they'll be writing the music for our festival. Oh, nice. The creative types sticking together. 
Uh, that's great. I think it'll be wonderful. Well, we should let Devin get back to work. <laughs> Guess I'll leave you in my house, Devin. Have fun. Don't rob me. Mm-hmm. Okay, so Devin's a little bit shy and awkward. <laughs> the passive aggressiveness between us and Ruth is really all I'm living for right now. Just... They're showing us, like, Ruth's showing us around the town and, and like, very clearly walking around with us and we're going to put some dust in. We're going to be like, not with Ruth, no. Psst, Ramsey. <gasps> Do you get the feeling people here don't like witchcraft? <gasps> <clears throat> there you are. I've been walking around with you th this last while, but, you know, I thought I'd lost you. Ten yards really does make a difference. Um, I think it's time I show you your home. Should have started with that. I'm exhausted. Someone with the garden, just this way. Don't they all have gardens? Which one do we reckon it is? Oh, well, garden. I mean, personally, I think they all kind of technically have gardens, but whatever. Where do you want to go? I want to go home. <gasps> it's so cute. Wow, it seems perfectly... <laughs> wow, seems perfectly adequate. Our expectations were low, but holy shit. Our previous witch used to live here. I'm not entirely sure who maintained it, but hopefully... Ruth, do you know of anything that's going on in your own town? I'm just checking in, Ruth. Are you okay? Hmm. It's a little quaint. It's kind of perfect. Let's be positive for once, shall we? This cauldron shall serve us nicely. Rubs hands gleefully. Yes, of course. Make sure to check your mailbox in the morning. That's how we send in our orders. The garden is just through that door. You'll find all the gardening equipment you need out there too. Then there's your wardrobe and bed. <laughs> Suddenly we're really into the details. There's also this moon altar. <laughs> you know, you've got your bed, your dishwasher, your toilet, your moon altar. We used to, she used to decorate it with items she found around Flora. I think that's everything. We are glad you're here to help us. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm afraid our village is tourist hired me out. I should let you get settled anyway. I'm gonna go back home and hope that I can get inside. Tomorrow's your first day on the job. Thanks for the tour. Of course. Goodbye now. And they never saw Ruth again. Yeah, all those introductions were a little awkward. They were a bit. I hope this unawkward is very soon. We need to find at least one friend that isn't a crow. Ugh. Tassels, enough of the pity party. Come on now. We're going to make the best of this. Something tells me by the end of this two weeks we're not going to want to leave. I don't want to be here. Getting to soon would have been so much easier. There's going to be a way to get out of this. Okay. Think, Tassels. Think! Wait, I've got it. There's a calendar here, right? Let's take a look at it. Yes. Yes, this is it. There's the festival. There's us. You're here. There's a f way. Hello. There's a full moon on the eighth. We just need to be as perfect, italicized, bold, uh, as we possibly can until then. Yeah. So we just gotta get halfway. This is what I tell myself when I work out. You just gotta get to here. If you can't get here, at least you get here. But then by the time you get there, you're fine. It's all in the mind. Then on the full moon, we'll perform a ritual that'll solve all their problems or whatever right then and there. <coughs> that's not that's not the spirit, sort of. Cheating? How is that cheating? It's called efficiency. You really wanna be stuck here for two weeks? It's two weeks, you'll survive. <coughs> Ramsey's probably perfectly happy here. Do you really want to go back to the family that you're really teed off at because they disowned you? Like, why would you want to go back there? Here, it's like you get your own cottage, got a garden, those other people, whatever, but you know. Do I really want to go back? Yeah. Okay, I need to read the thing. Uh, I don't know, but we need to get out of here first. The rest we can figure out later. You're, you're a witch. You do something witchy, you know. Teleport or whatever. Uh, I guess it's time to get some rest. I'm gonna need it for tomorrow. Oh, it's so cute. 
First day, full moon, festival. Oh, <gasps> Ramsey. Little backpack. So we've got a hundred. Hundred what? We don't know. Hundred gold coins. Hundred puppies. Hundred warts on our butt. We just there's no way to know. Um Moon Altar. Uh, uh. <laughs> Jump scare. But I want to look at everything. No. Oh, right. Okay. We're not allowed to look at things. Fine. Let me look at things. I will not. Okay, fine. Crow's telling me what to do. <sighs> Ooh. All right. Well, I'm not going to click on the wardrobe because it'll be the same thing. And the door. Click on the... Are you ready to end the day? Well, I'm going to read some messages first. Um, Ducks piloting a mech drunkenly says, Hi, Aoife, still glad to see you back. Any chance your gamer will have another crack at D&D? Love the Brick Quest Club shows. I can't say anything. I might want to, but I can't. So. Um... Uh, Kirsty Hands says, uh, have done my actual donation, but have, but have my member chat. Oh, thank you. Uh, thanks for making motherhood less scary, Aoife. It's not that scary. I mean, there, no, it's not that scary. I was going to say there are parts that, no, it's not scary. It's pretty wonderful, actually. Not to get all <laughs> gross with you or whatever, but, uh, um, yay, Leah. As someone who came out as trans recently, thank you for doing the stream and thank you to everyone who's donating. Oh, Leah, that's so awesome. Thank you for joining us. Um, and thank you for the super chat. Amazing stuff. Um, Steve or Stephen Orr says, uh, turned 40 last week and looking back on my life, all I've, at all I've seen and done, I now realize I never befriended even one crow. What have I been doing? Stephen, you're talking as if 40 is like too late to befriend crows. The world is your oyster. Grab some bread or whatever it is the crows like to eat. Go outside. Start today. You know, I've seen people befriend crow armies. Like there's still time. Um, Lord Kane thirty one ninety five says at work, so I much so I must watch later. Love you all. Oh, thank you, Lord Kane. Um, the incredible stuff. And you know, let's see. Uh, you are amazing, lady. With I can't read. Why would you? Why would? Why would it cover your lovely name that I can't read now? Lady with sw Is it? Sw is it swag? Is it? Sw What's the rest of your username, lady with sw? But anyway, thank you for the super chat. Um, and, uh, oh, there you go. Shelled peanuts. That's what crows like, according to Mara Reynolds. Um, and let's check in on our donations. <gasps> As if we're at 68%. No! Is everyone, like, I bet everyone's like, if I donate, we might push over the 69. Ah! I'm gonna miss the opportunity to go nice. No. Santo uh, Athios says science proves that trans folks have been around longer than their than the ideologies that attempt to suppress them. Yes. Ladle says I came out as trans nearly 20 years ago. Wow. Having resources and visibility and supportive community is so vital. Keep loving, keep fighting. Amazing. That's a lovely message. Thank you, Ladle. Um, Elijah T says, thank you so much, you're a gamer and the community. I didn't know I needed this love and support as a trans man today. Fuck turfs, just let us live. P.S. Congrats, Kim Petras for her Grammy win. Yes! Amazing stuff. Um, although I did see uh, a tweet saying that um, Kim Petras isn't the first trans woman to win a Grammy, but I can't remember the name of of who was. Um, maybe someone will put it in chat. Um, but yes, that is amazing. And Elijah, thank you so much um, for the message. Uh, thank you to all the anonymouses for donating as well. Uh, Kirsty Han says, as usual, appreciating EG and the work and vibes that you all bring. Robert Griffin says, great charity and good vibes. Just what I need today as I start training for my new job. Congrats. Virtual hugs for everyone. Uh, thank you, Hannah Rose. Thank you, Lloyd Maeve again. Uh, Sus, Connor S, Anonymous Rosie, Kieran Marshall. Thank you, Dom W. Good luck or a quick death. Thank you so much. Uh, Anonymous says, also welcome back. Thank you. <laughs> um, I'm going to refresh because I want to see if we're, we've gotten to 69. No, it's still 68. Oh, it's We're teetering on the edge. So close. Um, Wendy Carlos. Yes, thank you. Um... But yeah, that's pretty awesome. Crows do like shelled peanuts, apparently. Um, 
Oh, and Commander Vimes says, uh, Raven was checking in with me yesterday when I went to pick up their meds, so which is our allies? Ah, uh, I love it. I want, I just, all I want in life is a Corvid familiar. Why is it too much to ask? Um, ooh, can recommend scrambled eggs is a definite favorite for Corvid. I love that we're already with tips on how to make friends with Corvids. This is why this community is, is so incredible, you know? Like, amazing, amazing streams. And oh, we're, I knew that would happen. We're over. We're at 70%. I'm going to do it anyway. Nice. <sighs> we're at 70%. I mean, that's just incredible anyway. We're at 70% of the of the target. Um, <laughs> sorry. Why? Why no nice? But it, we just straddled it. And, you know, like, the... That 70% of that target is incredible anyway, so thank you. <laughs> Everyone's going nice anyway. I think we still deserve to say nice, so that's good. Um, uh, oh, and um, a, a little bit more on Wendy Carlos from Lloyd Maeve. Um, amazing electronic music composer and arranger. Did the soundtracks for The Shining, Clockwork Orange, Tron, etc. That's so incredible. Um, no, let's maybe end the day, I suppose. <gasps> Love it. <laughs> Alex Moore, a simple solution. Raise the target to 69.69. That's tempting. Victoria Hitris says, donated to the cause, but here's something to go towards your bird feet for your future feathery friend. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> No genius is right. You got it at 68 and 70. That averages to nice. So that's good enough. Catherine Clark, Soggy Catfit, also enjoyed by Crows. Incredible. <laughs> Just incredible scenes. Is it morning already? I think it's time for beauty magic. Can I sleep a little longer? Let's get back to that experiment. What is that experiment we keep talking about? I don't get to sleep longer anymore. So no sympathy for you tassels, I'm afraid. I was up at 3 o'clock today. Then four, then five, then I was allowed to sleep until seven. I mean, you know, whatever. You get over it really fast. It's just, it's just, it's just how it is now. Um, huh? I have work to do. Oh, I thought that was a bad dream. Well, maybe if you didn't remind me, I could have stayed in my ignorant bliss. Gotta face reality sometime, tassels, and everyone will be amazed. Yes, yes, I will go and check my mail. I will go and check my mail now. Oh, so pleased. What a great day. Your treat? <gasps> One crow treat. What are we going to give? What are we going to give them? No, that's enough for. Oh. <laughs> if you gave them too many, it wouldn't be a treat. All right. I mean, I say that as if I don't give kitty treats kind of near constantly. Um, ooh. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. I'm sure it has... Oh, all right. All righty, what do we have here? Oh, God, Ruth. Uh, looks like our first request is from Ruth, the mayor. Let's see what intentions and associations we can pull from her. <laughs> Having a normal one. Um... Dear Tassels, I'm sure it's nothing to worry about, but I've been feeling a little detached from everyone recently. You don't say, Ruth. I've, been, I've especially felt disconnected from the festival. I do still care, but who knows? Maybe some incense could help me work through things. Smell yourself better. What are these? What is this? Looks like Ruth needs some relationship-focused focus, incense with a pink ingredient and another one associated with Paletto. Interesting. So, so basic. I don't want to be. So, stop making me be. D d d not mean, but just, yeah, apathetic, I guess. Uh, Grant always blows things out of proportion. <coughs> Fine, I'll quit complaining and keep reading. Jeez. Except. It's Mel and I's anniversary soon. Mel likes magic. Perhaps a potion that could help us celebrate our current and future happiness together and being a good That's nice. See, thoughtful. It's love. It's orange. And it's... What? I don't know what that is. I'm trying to figure out symbols. I mean, I know that's... 
I hope I'm not bothering you. Could you craft some incense that attracts positive energy? Ideally something that promotes tranquility, maybe happiness too. So it's protection spell? It's blue. And it's, is that Saturn? I saw the rings there. Yeah, none of these seem too complicated. I guess it's time to gather materials and ingredients. We can go to the general store to purchase bottles and stuff. Or gather ingredients from the garden. Which one do you think we should do first? Garden? Garden's right there. I should open my room more. Yes. Yes. Thank you, Exposition Crow. Press G to open your grimoire. Ooh. Okay. Inventory. We have none of these things. Resin, vial, sachet, bottle, compost, calendula, uh, yarrow, hollyhock, geranium, lavender. Ooh, smells nice. Rose, chamomile, pea flower, onion? Is that an onion flower? Oh, never mind. And then some rocks, some stuff, more stuff, water, water the lavender when it goes a bit gray, compost it when it's a bit mulchy, give it compost when it's like that. Oh, there you go, and here, you, there's all the stuff, so we need calendula, we need pea flower, we need hollyhock. Recipes. Ooh. Oh, there's so many things. So we need to learn some of these, don't we? Tons of stuff. Tons of stuff. Orders. Pium, pium, pium. Okay. Alright. So now we go to the garden of the village shop, right? <coughs> Through the door we go. How do we get to the- can we not- is there no other door here? Can we not go out to the- I wonder what goes up here. Um... Loading. Oh. No, I don't want to change. But that's nice to know that we can. We can just change our outfit whenever we like- okay. Oh. It's like, did I break it? Did I break it? Alright. Ka ka. Time to gather. We can go to the general store to purchase bottles and stuff, or gather. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. I've already done this. Yes, I've already done this. Thank you. Okay, I have to apparently. There. Nice. Very well. Through the door we go, I guess. Let's go through the door. Ah, right, gotcha. <gasps> it's so pretty. What? Oh. Yes, I know, it's my problem now regardless. Gotta pick water and weed. At least it seems we've got a compost bin. We can probably use that to turn weeds into fertilizer. I should probably help the plants. Yay, gardening! Yeah. Yeah! Oh. Wow. Okay. So everything's really well maintained, right? Use the gardening tools to tend your garden. First harvest the flowers and herbs with the shears. Make sure to water them after you harvest to ensure they bloom the next day. So the rose, lavender, rosemary, camp will take an extra day. Okay. You can also pull the weeds while using the gardening gloves. Nice. The weeds can then be turned into fertilizer at the compost bin. Fertilizer helps the plants in your garden grow faster. Okay, well, let's... Let's harvest some of these. Looks like they all need a little bit of harvesting. And then let's water all these. There you go, there you go, there you go, and then did anything need some comp- What did- Oh yeah, pick the weed, weed, weed. Oh, it's so f- oh, this is- oh, this is fun though. Did anything need compost? Um, yeah, you can also pull weeds, fertilizer. Oh, so just fertilize the ones if I want them to go back faster? Never mind. There we go, it's all very happy. Let's go up here now. Um, some peas, peas. Let's prune them all back. 
There you go. Some for you, some for you, some for you, some for you. Yes, I might get used to this. Pretty good at the old gardening, I think you'll find. Got loads of stuff now. Is that separate? Is that a wolf? No. Is it? No. Let's go up here. And pull these weeds. And pium, 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 pium. I'm sure it won't always be this easy. I'm sure it's going to get harder to stay on top of all the water. Like, it's been left in very good nick, so hopefully the longer we can keep it in good nick, the less difficult it'll be. I don't think anything needs compost just yet. Yes! Nice. Hey! Sweet. Does anything need composting? Where's my grimoire? I could, or does it instantly? Let's try. Oh, it does. Okay, very well. That's fine. I don't think we need. That's if you. That's uh, so. I suppose that's if we really needed some, like right away. Okay. Well, let's keep the compost in the back pocket, though not literally, because we'd stink. Um. Okay. How do we leave? Oh, there we go. Gardening done. Village to the shop with our hundred something. Hello, my name is Jimena. You must be Tassels, the new witch. I knew it was a good idea to keep my old stock around. No good throwing things away that someday someone might buy. It's called hoarding, Jimena. It's not always good. I also carry some antiques at a premium price. Why would you tell us that that's a premium price? You should tell us that it's an absolute bargain. Not so good at the old sales. My daughter sends them to me when she's off on her travels. She always says she'll visit with her girlfriend, but we'll see. You know what? I'm suddenly feeling very generous. Are you and I? Take some of this resin and these bottles, vials, and sachets free of charge. Thank you. Um, again, not really how business works, but sure. But now it's time for my mid-morning tea, so I must close this shop. Is Gemini okay? Like, did, I suppose in such a small town you just run things however you want, eh? Enjoy the supplies! Um, okay. Ah, wah. Pretty generous. Pretty strange. I did not. Didn't get a chance to. I hope she was kidding about having to buy them. Anyway, looks like I've got everything to start cranking out these spells. Love to crank one out in the middle of the day. Um, let's get back inside and check out the crafting altar. Yes, yes. Um, let's craft some stuff. I've got some flowers, herbs, and some bottles, vials, and stuff as base materials. So, let's craft some spells. Let's make some magic. Of course, I don't know what spells. Pretty sure it said what plants match which association, so let's open it up and go from there. Oh, look, that's where our things go. Do we hang them up on the wall? That's nice. Okay. Orders. Click a character portrait to pin their order, then go to the plant section to match symbols from the orders to the plants. Click the chest of drawers to view your available plant ingredients. There should be three plant ingredients total. Make sure to check the type of spell the villager wants to. You can see what base material matches what spell type in the recipes section. Click the base materials on the altar to cycle through the ones you have in your inventory. Once you think you have the right ingredients and base material, click the cauldron to craft the spell. Okay. Gotcha. Don't gotcha. I wasn't listening to any of that. No, right. I was. Orders. Okay. Ruth. Ruth needs incense. We're figuring out her feelings. Uh, so, so what now? <laughs> yes. Click a character portrait to pin their order. Then go to the plant section to match. Right. This is. Can we not? Right. 
Click their character portrait to pin the order, then go to the plants section to see what plants, then click the chest of drawers to view your available plant ingredients. Yes. Right. Good. <laughs> right, I'm clicking the character portrait to... to... do this bit right now. Good. Okay. Now... go... uh... D d plants. Plants. Was that in the ground? Okay. Plants! Right. See? Uh... But there's not one for like... There's not one for pink and also Pluto. So... It should be three plants total. So Allium. Hollyhock. Uh... Um, right, so, right, like, so why is it this, why, it shouldn't be this hard, hold on, there were only like two steps, uh, okay, I'm, <laughs> they're pinned, it's all good, okay, uh, Hold on. Rose? 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 Let's have a wee joke. Where's the rose? It wasn't- where's the- where is it? But that's not- But that's not pink though. Oh, but it is the heart. Oh. Oh, so it would be- so it would be rose, hollyhock, and allium. Yes. Let's go with that. Yeah? And- Allium, which was the the onion plant? Onion flower? Let's have a wee joke again. Yes. There. That looks that looks about right to me. Hmm. Oh. I should reach out. Oh. Well. D Where did <laughs> um wait I totally know how to do this you guys um let's see let's see I'm going to I'm going to check messages so that I can have a think on this uh I'm not running away from my problems not at all not even slightly um let's scroll back up Rhino Surprise glad to see you back Aoife here's to love and inclusivity yes thank you Rhino Surprise and that's your first super chat hooray I love that these new to I tell you what what an exciting time that there's so much new stuff uh, YouTube is doing um, uh, that I can like I can enjoy that there we go um, it might not be new to you but remember I haven't streamed in like six months you also need the incenses Helen but where is the but what but where is incense you need to make it an incense by clicking on the bottle thanks everyone okay so let's throw that back in there was that one that one that one. Yeah. Did I? No. But. I should recheck the ingredients and base material. Oh, so wait. Is it? Hold on. Right. Hold on, I know what you mean. It's not a vial, resin, sachet, bottle. So what does incense take then? Ah! We've done it! Yay! <laughs> I remembered to hide a video game. Ooh. Keep crafting, we know how to do it now. So this is fine. This is fine. Okay. Who's next? Who's next? Orders. Vaughn. Potion for his anniversary. Ah. Oh. So. What does he want? A potion. It's a potion. Therefore. Bottle is correct. And. Then. Oh look. Yay. Um, 
plants. We need rose. We need calendula. And we need... Wait, I saw it there. Hollyhock again. So, two of the same ingredients. So it's rose, calendula, and hollyhock, right? I believe. Yeah. Yay! See? No problem. This is fine. This is fine. What are you worried about? Happy love potion. Shouldn't need a potion for it, really. Why don't we know? Keep crafting. As long as we're not, again, going back to the rewatching Buffy thing. As long as we're not in a tabula rasa kind of situation, because that's bad times for everyone. Um, let's see. One more order, wasn't it? Devin wanted some positive and peaceful incense. So we know this. We need that for their incense. We need blue and we need it to be protect. Blue protection and. I, I think it was Saturn. So I'm going to go out in a limb and say that it's. Uh, pea flower. Pea flower, yarrow, and rosemary. Oh, I love a bit of rosemary. Pea flower, yarrow, delicious rosemary. Not just good for roasts. Hooray! Okay. One gaming achieved, <laughs> says Mara Reynolds. Amazing. I think we're finished. That's all our orders. Um, <gasps> we're at 80%! We just raised 4,000 pounds. That's incredible. 80% of our goal. Amazing stuff, everyone. Natalia De, De Maria uh, says, Thank you guys so much for creating a safe gaming space for all of us. Uh, Liv in Ingen um, says, uh, Fuck Turfs, fuck JKR. Thanks to all of the lovely people who donated in the last 15 minutes. Incredible. Thank you, Liv. That's amazing. Um, IJL, uh, Joe Harper, Dave F. Thank you all so much. Uh, l useless Lesbian Shannon says, Trans rights are human rights. Trans people are coming under a lot of fire right now, but the community stands with you all. I personally swear to always have your back. We will stand with you in this fight. I'm absolutely right. Thank you, useless lesbian. Thank you, Shannon. <laughs> um, and uh, Kiz, uh, Limited Patient, says, Just dropping by to give Aoife and the rest of Team EG thanks on behalf of the community and for nurturing a wonderful place to hang out. That's all... That's all these guys. That's all this amazing community. Um, I just provide the location. Um, I wish I could provide the snacks too, but unfortunately, that's on you. Um, Andrea uh, Surumi says, uh, well, they don't say anything, but thank you so much, Andrea. Um, Anonymous, thank you. Thank you for supporting our beautiful community. Cass, great work as always, and thank you for the stream. Um, Anonymous, thank you so much. Becca, thank you so much as well. Um, thank you for the channel for supporting such an important cause. Semantic Poetry. Um, Laura Tallhurst, always happy to support your gamers' excellent charity streams. Love and support to all, all today. Glenn Pepper, trans rights are human rights. Thank you all so, so much. Wow. I think we might actually make it to 100% um, with less than an hour to go. I think it's possible. Um, but really, you know, the, the donations are all so, so appreciated. I mean, of course they are. Um, and the generosity, as always, is just incredible with this community. But more important today was just a show of love and support um, for everyone who's affected by, you know, a lot of the not so nice messaging going on right now. It's like, it's just, it's hard to see. I mean, and I'm sure it's even harder to be um, at the moment. There's just a lot of rhetoric and a lot of, <clears throat> you know, just horrible messaging going on right now that, that suggests trans people aren't in, like loved and included but they absolutely are and you know nothing nothing about us without us um should really apply to so much of the you know chat going on in the uk especially right now um but this will always be a safe space and just lots of love to to everyone um, going through it right now. Um, Joseph Kunkar says, right, I gotta go walk the dog, but it's been wonderful to see you back, Aoife. Trans rights are human rights? Absolutely. Um, now we have to wonder the exact effects of a love potion, says Dr. Branger. Um, 
Uh, well, that's lots of lovely messages. I can't keep up, unfortunately, but <laughs> Shannon Bennett says, you're telling me there's two useless lesbians named Shannon in this chat? Oh no, oh my God. Just uh, just an existen existential crisis going on right now. Um, I'm enjoying this music, it's quite nice. Um, all done, time to deliver these amazing spells. Yes, positivity. We're projecting it out there. Uh, and then everyone will be super impressed and my gran will realize my genius. A little more self-serving than I was hoping for, Tassels, but sure, it's a step in the right direction. Hey now, a witch is allowed to dream. Let's just get this done. Oh, I like that, look. All of our herbs hanging up. Our bed's right there. What's our moon altar doing? Wow, this is a fancy altar. I'm totally going to decorate this thing. It looks like there's a spot for my taro deck too. Ooh. I don't know what... I don't... I, ooh. I don't know what all of these are for, but that's nice. Ooh. Oh, you can actually do... That's fun. I don't know how, I don't know how to taro read, I'm afraid. Ooh! I knew, somehow I knew, somehow I knew that would be in there. But it doesn't mean death in a literal sense. It can mean new beginnings, all that good stuff. <laughs> Ow, my feelings. The tire. The moon. What does it mean? The physical. Death, end of a cycle, renewal, release, metamorphosis. Hmm. Free-spirited, carefree, optimistic, new experience. Well, new experience seems to be a theme here. Frivolous, impulsive. Uh, face reality, damage, exhaustion, humiliation, upheaval. Okay. Uh, inner self, disillusioned, inst What are we trying to say here, game? Eh? What's, what's, what's all this about? Hmm? What, what, someone, <laughs> someone who can tire read and help me. Uh, well, I didn't know it was actually going to do it. Maybe I'll just do it. Three card spread lets you look deeper into a situation. Okay, wait. One card spread. Daily inspiration. All right, let's do some daily inspiration, everyone. Let's think positive stuff. <laughs> I judge us to be... To be... To be happy and, you know, positive ab about everything that's going on in the world right now. But, you know, realistically so also. Not apathetic. Self-awareness, resurrection, maturity, rite of passage. There we go. Or something. That's alright, you know. Resurrection, new beginnings, maturity, rite of passage. It means we're, like, going through things that will lead to... Um you know, new, higher learning and better things are on the horizon, right? That's fun. Okay. Some some stuff, some stuff. Um. Okay. Such a conflicting message, says VE. I know. <laughs> when Taro becomes Tar- Oh, says EA wants it to. Okay. All right. Should we go and give out our spells? Let's go do that. Wait, you're not coming with me? I've got to do this on my own? Please, Ramsey. Don't make me do it. Well, we were talking about maturity and rite of passage, right? Stop trying to wheedle your way into the crow's good graces. <laughs> <laughs> We're so dramatic, I love it. Village! The village! Stupid Ramsey. I have to make him a special snack. I have to give him my love and support. Ugh. Made of. Dang it! Why do crows have to like everything? Talking to strangers is awful, I'll be honest. I do avoid it when I can, too. When I'm not prepared for it, it's difficult. Alright. 
Um, let's go to Devon first. I feel like they, they're, they, you know, they were the least, I want to say, outwardly hostile. No one was hostile, but you know what I mean. Talk, talk to Devon. They might be fine. First delivery. Maybe I should have started with Ruth. Gotten it over with. Oh well. <laughs> you arrive somewhere completely different to talk to a person that doesn't live there. Yeah. You should probably do your best not to make any sudden movements. Tassels, right? Yep. Yep, yep. <gasps> We're such a disaster. Uh, I think it was this one. Yeah, it was protection-y. Oh, there it is. Listen. Listen. I'm tired, okay? It's a long six months. Uh, right, I hope Ruth and Nisha like them. Hmm. I wonder why. Probably because Ruth's not there, being weird. Uh, back home, my family uses these to cleanse our house once a season. It's just a little ritual we do, but I've always liked it. Yep. It's been around for ages. Oh, there you go. So Devon's a bit more used to witchcraft. That's why they're a bit more chill. Everyone in the village loves him. I think our village is a little more open to magic than Flora. Hmm. Not that that's a bad thing. Yeah, I can't tell if folks are happy to have me here or not. Their welcoming was a little odd. If you can even call it a welcome. Though I guess I wasn't exactly what they asked for. Sorry, didn't mean to upset you. Huh? You're not? I don't know. I just have to show them how great I am. Confidence is my middle name. Or my curse. Yes, just call us Tassel's Confidence, Von Teasel. I'm a little jealous, even with your quirks. Quirks? What quirks? Yeah. Should enjoy being you. The only thing you can be. Even though you must feel lonely not knowing anyone here. Hi, Ramsey. The complete truth? <gasps> Do tell. All right, Devin. Bit of a diner. Is this what it's normally like talking to other people? Because I suddenly feel very heavy. Nisha says I have a way of reaching into people's souls and crushing them. No wonder Devin has confidence issues. Is this witchcraft? No, just me projecting my anxieties. Oh, listen, fake it till you make it, Devin. Just, just assume it's gonna be fine, because it usually is. Worrying only means suffering twice. Uh, oh. And when I confronted her about it, she just said, oops. Mm. Time to rise to the challenge. Even though human friends are overrated sometimes, this is, this is what... This is the, the pep talk I think Devin needs. Yes, you do. Come on. Be bold, Devin. Be brave. But I don't want to be... <laughs> Honestly relatable, but, you know, that's not going to solve any problems. I just wanted to hang out this summer. So now the pressure is on to perform in front of a bunch of people. I don't know. Uh-oh. Oh, in a way. <laughs> oh. Oh. That's so cute. Wow. Why is this a different color? What's going on? It is almost romantic, but also it does sound like true friendship. Ah! Why is this a different color? Is this a romantic path? I'm gonna do it. <gasps> it's a flirting option. Yes. Yes. Get ready to be flirted with, Tyna Flora. I guess anything that feels like fate is. 
Maybe both of us being here in Florida right now is also fate too. Hmm. Hmm. Oh no. Time for another emergency change of subject. I don't... I don't have friends! <laughs> oh god. Abort! Abort! That explains a lot. Wow. Savage. That's fine. Putting yourself out there. Yeah! 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 <gasps> okay. Okay. Yes. We're friends now. We're friends now. We're friends now. Bye, friend. <laughs> what adorably awkward people. <laughs> Somewhere in that zone. It's a strange feeling. A very strange feeling indeed. Time to see what the next deliveries have in store for me. All right. Wow. Well, there you go. Wolf is, Wolf's brain says, uh, chill game to fall asleep to for my post-work nap. Much love and sweet dreams to all you trans folk. Have a good sleep. Everyone keep the noise down. Wolf's brain is sleeping. Uh, let's see if we've had any more donations. <gasps> We're at 90%. Ooh, it's so close. It's so close with 40 minutes to go. Wow. Peter Smart, thank you for the donation. Anonymous, thank you. Morgan, thank you so much. Bayonetta's first suit of modesty. <laughs> uh, Codex, thank you. Um, uh, Codex says, thank you for helping raise money for a deserving charity. I'm so part of this amazing and inclusive community. Trans rights are human rights. Fuck turfs. <laughs> um, Anonymous, thank you so, so much. Stephen Orr, thank you. Eve Bolland, love to all my trans siblings and allies. Anonymous, thank you so, so much. Wow. That is incroyable. 90% already. Phew. I put it down and I was like, it, you know, the target doesn't really matter. It's just, we're all just here to have a nice time. But it is a, it is amazing. It's such short notice as well um, that everyone is so, so generous. Um, Amber Blackwell, thank you as well for the super chat. Um, as a trans person, I just want to thank you guys for doing some good given the current climate we as a community are so tired i cannot imagine how tired you are i mean it's just it's just really it's so hard to see a community that is you know so vulnerable so open so wonderful as i i know them to be um just get unfairly attacked all the time so I can't imagine what it is like to be under attack all the time but I just hope that this little stream today and all of the wonderful messages that everyone have been send has been sending in just go a little way to, to help um, that's my hope right are we going to Jean let's go to Jean next and let's end I guess we have to end with Ruth or whatever um oh baking Does nobody in the, this town close their door? Oh no, Jean, are you in there? My first day on the job, my client might be burning to a crisp, but at least it's not my fault. <laughs> That's the spirit, sort of. Uh, Jean is in there. I've got to go help him out. Hang on, Jean, I'm coming in. <coughs> Once open, the smoke quickly dissipates from the house. What happened? Are you okay? Jean looks down at a bacon sheet full of burnt something. I see. Was it croissants? Uh, got your potion? It was the happy love potion. Jean, maybe, ignoring you, starts cleaning up the burnt mess. Well, fine. Guess I'll just leave this here. I'll take that as a yes. What kind of business are we running, Tassels? We're not taking payment for these things? He looks very angry. Maybe chatting will help take his mind off things. So, it's your anniversary. A little bit of, a little bit of love action. I, I guess. Any fun plans with your wife? Romantic? 
we're not getting anything out of Gene. We're just we're just making him angrier. Yep. Please leave. <laughs> no. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Bye then. He's mean. All right. Note to self: avoid Jean. Talk to Ruth. As if Ruth is not the most hostile person here. You woke up and knock on the door. Tassels, good to see you. Can I help you with something? Yep. Right. <laughs> Wrong place! I thought this was your house. Turns out, everywhere's your house. Uh, there you go. One batch of reconnection incense, handmade by yours truly. Don't know why, I just assume they'd be doing finger guns. Wonderful, how exciting! These should help me get me back into the swing of things. You're not excited about the festival? Oh, I wouldn't say that. It's just been hard to motivate myself recently. Perhaps my old age is finally catching up with me. 40 years! Yeah, I'll job security in Flora. <laughs> Same mind. Does sound like a long time when you put it that way. You must be like the best mayor ever to get elected for 40 years straight. Or there's nobody else around for the job. No, I don't know about that. Mostly I ran uncontested. Flora is a small village, so there aren't many people vying for my position. No, I suppose Flora hasn't always been small. So much has changed over the years, especially the festival, and perhaps not for the better. Sorry, you don't want to hear the grumbles of an old lady. No worries. <laughs> yes, your grandmother is the grumbling sort. Even when she was younger. Oh yes, yeah, she never liked being told what to do. And she acts like I'm the bratty one. Grandmothers. We are the ones that ruin all the fun. That's not true. Grandmothers are the one. Like, I. Like, grandmothers are the ones who, like, spoil you. And. Because they don't have to deal with the consequences of you getting overexcited, sugared up, you know, staying up late. All of it. Does that mean a grandmother shouldn't be in charge of the festival? That is a good question. We've got to do our best to keep up. I love this festival because of the energy of everyone coming together towards a common goal. Not that everyone isn't working hard now, I know they are, but somehow it doesn't feel the same. Well, for me at least. Oops. I did it again. Wait, were you only excited for the festival because other people were excited about the festival? Yes, it's infectious. Oh, because that would mean you were never truly excited for the festival. No, just hold on a second. It's part of my job as mayor to make sure others are excited, not just my... I think I know why you've run uncontested all these years. Oh. Well, these are kind of mean, so let's go with the middle one. Having to keep everyone happy to make sure you're happy? That sounds like... Huh? huh? It's that same expression from yesterday. Did you lose focus again? Whoa! That scared the shit out of me. Oh, we did get paid. Never mind, sorry. It's a task at hand. Oh. What just happened? I do hope you enjoy your stay in Flora. We're so happy to have your assistance during this time. I must get back to my mayoral duties, if you don't mind. Have a lovely rest of your day. Oh, dear. Things are not what they seem. Things, things are happening. Which means at least I get to go home now. I think I'm ready for a nap. <laughs> you did three deliveries. Calm down. Let's go home. What happened? What happened, though? Is Ruth evil? Is Ruth a robot? What's... Is she possessed? What's going on? Who can say? I'm home! People are weird. What, it really took you that? Oh, we've got lots of money now. It is. It is hard. Okay. I guess everyone seemed friendly except that Jean guy. He kicked me out of his voice. And before I, you asked, no, I did not nearly set it on fire. He did. I actually tried to save him. But I guess Devin and I are friends now because they also don't have friends, or at least not many. And the mayor seems a little, a, a lot off. I don't know. It's been a weird day. I think I just want to go to sleep now. Yeah, I just gotta keep it up until the filming, and then it'll all be sorted. Yes. 
You want a treat? Treats, treats, treats. Ow! Your treat. <laughs> One treat coming up. Ow, ow. I want to give him another treat. You sneaky bird. I'm giving him another treat. Why? 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 Why not? So we don't have any more orders, unfortunately. So we can't do anything here. We've done our garden. Do we have to just go to sleep? I think so. All right. Yes, nap time. Ooh, there's some uh, some th different theories in chat now about what's going on. Badger Fudge. It's interesting she mentioned the town didn't used to be small. Maybe something else has been reducing the population? Mmm. Because nothing weird ever happens at a full moon, says Tim the monkey. Interesting. Fascinating. <gasps> ah! We've got... We're 103%! We made it! Amazing! We're over five grand raised for mermaids. That's incredible! Thank you all so, so much. Anonymous, anonymous, thank you. Anonymous, thank you. Erlyn, uh, almost there. Keep up the good work. Paranormal sponge kick. Amazing. Uh, keep up the great work, guys. Trans rights or human rights. Amazing. More anonymouses. Hanoons, thank you. Chris Manson, much love to all my trans pals. Sable Eagle, um, Tuck Furfs. <laughs> thank you. Amazing. Wow. I can't believe it. Oh, there's so many generous anonymi anonymize. Anonymous is, is, is out there. That's incredible. Target is smashed. Wow. Well, I think that is, that's an amazing way to say that the EG community um, came out in force to support uh, our trans siblings today. Um, and that is very heartwarming. It's a lovely feeling. Um, <laughs> next stop, 169%, says Andy. Ooh, 103. Oh, we couldn't, it's only a half an hour to go. I don't know if we could do that, but that would be incredible. Wow. Should we, and <laughs> I can't, I believe the collective term is anonymize. <laughs> should I up it to like 110%? Like, let me know what I, if I should, like, it's only a half an hour, so... I don't know if we should if we should touch it at all, if we should just let it be. But if anyone has any suggestions, I'm all up for that. Um, it's morning again. And we have more orders already? So we better get started. Alright, let's have a look. What have we got? Hello, Tassels. This is my first time writing to a real witch. So exciting! Anyway, I've been dealing with a stubborn supplier who won't give me what I need. Do you have a charm to change my circumstances? I still have much to do. Protection. Pink. Titty. I don't know what that... Let's assume singular singular tit. Um, Yo, tassels! My stomach is a nuts. I'm so nervous about this whole being in charge thing. How do I tell people what to do? Are they even going to like me? You got a potion for that? Help! Star. Blue. Magic hitch. Hey, tassels! You know, what, you know how I'm working on that art piece for the festival? Well, I'm trying to look into my inner outer self for that spark, if you know what I mean. So what do you say about helping me achieve my artistic greatness with a potion? Says Nisha. Star. Yellow. Titty. Amazing. How many titties today? Oh, it's the sun. <laughs> Says Dr. Branger. I like my descriptor better. To be honest. Uh, orders. Let's see. So let's do the one first. So pink, shield, titty. Uh, so rosemary. Rosemary. Oh, it's like a dark pink though. Rosemary, geranium, and calendula. Okay. Rosemary, geranium, calendula. Rosemary, calendula. There we go. Oh, and what was it then? A charm? So that's... Uh, a bag. A baggie. We need baggies for charms. There we go. Alright. <laughs> Alright. A singular tid. <laughs> Rather than tiddies. The singular is tid. Keep crafting. Alright. Uh, orders, let's do Jonas's, 
star blue H, so it's the P. Uh, chamomile, chamomile, geranium, P flower. Chamomile, geranium, P flower. Chamomile, geranium, P flower. Chamomile, P flower. Which one was uranium? I forget what he looks like. This one. Okay. And it's a. Uh, it's a. Uh, it's a. Uh, potion. So it's just a ball. So wait. There we go. Ta da! Titties are magical, to be fair. You are right. Ooh, a leadership potion. Keep crafting. And then one more order, I believe. Nisha wants a potion, so it's that. And it's star yellow titty. So it's chamomile. And yarrow. And... Oh, no! I'm gonna have to go into the garden. Hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna... All right, we gotta go harvest some. <gasps> See, I knew it. God damn it! <sighs> See, look, it's not. A Hi, is there so much? Hi, Hi, Why so quickly? Um, do I have to water them more than once or something? Surely not. That's fine. Okay. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. <gasps> Alrighty. There we go. Looking a bit happier there. Nice, nice, nice. And pull up the weeds. Lovely. Everyone looks happy. Everyone good. Sweet. And snip, snip. That's what we need. Oof, they all look so sad before they've been watered. There we go. Pull up my weeds. Get out the weed whacker. There we go. Everyone happy? Everyone? Yes. So let's go back in. Finish off our spell. Huh. <laughs> yeah, but I'm going to finish this. Wait a second, bud. Just one, one minute. One minute. I just want to finish this first. All right. So. Yellow. Uh, yes. And titty. Which is... There we go. All right. And it's a potion. So it's a glass bottle, which we have. There we go. Aha! Finished! Can I help you, bird? Huh, you got something for me? <laughs> but only if I give you a treat first. Well, okay. Fine. <gasps> a crystal. Crystal pants bars. Rose quartz. <gasps> Where'd you find this? Ooh. Yes. Don't know what for yet, but first crystal. All right. So we've got all our orders. Don't know what the crystals are for yet. Can we put it there? No. We don't know what they. I shouldn't be messing with the altar when I don't know what it does yet. But let's do a wee tarot reading. Why not? Let's do a three card spread. Past influences present current state and what the future holds. Okay. Past. Oh. Whoopsie. The past is justice. Decision making, deliberation, fairness, negotiation. Okay. So we've done all that. So the present. The high priestess. Inner knowing, intuition, introspection, dreams in isolation. So we've done our thinking. We've done our work. And now we need to sit on it and reflect. Right? On ourselves. And the outcome is going to be... 
the outcome is going to be the consequence of everything that we've done. Nice and vague. Cool. It's all about cycling, adapting, going with the flow. Got it. That kind of works. Sort of tracks a little bit, I suppose. Okay. The village, please. Okay. Ah. Where? I already helped them. Ah. Just to do it? <laughs> but isn't that... But isn't that work? Ah. It's just nice. Ramsey is the moral compass of the group. Um... I suppose I can find the time. Amazing. Oh, I didn't check in with what everyone, what we should do with the target. Um, we just got sidetracked by titties, which is on brand, let's be honest. Um, amazing. Uh, <laughs> definitely seeing double. Four messages. I mean, two messages. Simpsons references are always welcome here. Um, I'm seeing double. Four crusties. Um... Well, that is just... We're at 105%. I think that's... I mean, with 20 minutes to go, that is... That's... Why not 169%, says Anonymous. Well, listen, if we're... You know, we should... We should a lot of Anonymous donations. Y'all are just just very generous. Generous and, and mysterious. Um, I mean, we got to give people incentive to be donating after the fact as well, don't we? So, maybe... I will edit it for 169 only because... Wait, I need to actually work out what 169% is. Someone who, who knows economics help. My family is dying. What's... I need to... Because I can't put in the percentage. I need to put in the actual number that will give us 100... Oh, no, wait. I'm thinking of this all wrong. 169% is just based on the donations. I don't need to change the target. Dang it. Again. Tired. Okay, you, he you heard how many times I was up last night. Not only do I need to make deliveries today, but I also have to check on yesterday's deliveries. That full moon ritual better work. Okay, well I guess... Let's start down here. Talk to Devin first, because they're our friend now. First check-in. And if it didn't, they better not tell me about it. Tassels, my new friend! I didn't order a spell, did I? No, this is quality control. Oh, it was really lovely. Ruth got into it and cooked Nisha and me a huge dinner. Aww, we could barely finish all the food. Where was my invite, Devin? As your new friend? Is everything alright? Oh, sorry, I'm just thinking about music. <laughs> Devin's such a goober. Oops, are you in the middle of composing things? Eh, sort of. I'm like in the middle of thinking about what kind of things I should be composing. No, it's not a problem. Actually, I was thinking about taking a little tea break. You want to join me? Would I? Whoa, a tea expert? I'm afraid I only have black tea. No worries, as long as you have cream and honey. I do. Cream? In tea? In tea? Is, is that not strange? You take a seat at a little table in the music studio. Devin brings over a tray with two mugs, cream and honey. That is strange, isn't it? You, you can put cream in your coffee. I don't think you put cream in your tea. Don't worry, I think I've got... Whoops. <gasps> Didn't mean to fall for you there. I'm doing it. <gasps> Whoops. Accidentally made them fall in love with us. The tea. I think so. Thanks for catching me. Of course. Oof. Get yourself together, Tassels. So this is a music studio. Yep. Lots of instruments here, too. It's great. Haha, <laughs> no. I mostly play guitar, but I can also play the piano. Oh, uh, never mind. You don't have to if you don't want to. Thanks. I have never met a musician who doesn't immediately want to play music when asked. That's... Come on now, normally they need to be discouraged, if anything. You should probably save your courage for the festival then. Yeah, I'm gonna need it. <laughs> oh. It's lovely. Everyone has been really welcoming, even though they all seem a little on edge. I guess it's a pretty big, busy time right now. My village isn't too dissimilar when we're busy preparing for our festival. Is 
Suddenly, Devin grows serious. What's up? I have a question for you. Uh-oh. Sure, ask away. You don't seem like that bad. <laughs> like that bad of a person? Ow. <laughs> Sorry. What I mean to say is, why? Why no friends? Hmm. But you don't want to talk to other witches sometimes, at least? Witches tend to be pretty solitary. I guess we do have to study a lot. Well, I don't, but others do. <laughs> and then there's a lot of spending time with nature and stuff, so... I don't know. Hard to make time. Hmm. We would attend the occasional ritual, but my grand is pretty solitary most of the time. I thought the Von Teasels were an illustrious family. We are, but I guess you could say they don't like me much. Oh god, here we go. Don't get us started on our family. I'm too much. Never too much. Give us more, not less. Uh, I'm sorry. But you must be pretty close to your grand then. Yeah. But she still tells me no a lot of the time, too. Uh, I suppose it is. Don't worry. That's what friends are for. Thanks. <gasps> Romantic. Pour the tea. Music doesn't write itself, unfortunately. Yeah. See ya. Yeah. They do need to get a little bit more confidence from somewhere. Huh, what's this strange tingly feeling? Color white? Why am I thinking about that right now? Dreams and hope and stuff. I've never had a feeling like this before though. Interesting. Maybe I should write this down somewhere in my grimoire. Hmm. Is this? <gasps> we made an actual friend. Friendship. A friendship. Okay. I guess let's talk to Nisha. Ahoy hoy. Of course. Definitely by not sitting in chairs properly. I know a fellow bisexual when I see one. Eyes are closed and she's muttering something. You take a few steps closer to figure out what's going on. <sighs> no, you know, breathing. Just breath stuff. Down to your fingertips. Inhale. Exhale. You know you're not supposed to talk while meditating, right? Silence is kind of the point. <laughs> it's my mind! <laughs> uh. Gimme! Gimme the good stuff! <laughs> Ugh. Cobbenpollen. Oh, so they read Cobbenpollen as well. Huh? What? Two great questions. Wait, does Nisha know about... Mm. Oh. Oh yeah, what's the deal with that again? Oh! The inspiration potion. Creative block, is it? I'm not blocked, I'm just trying to reach new heights, is a good way of putting it. It's a process. Trust the process. <laughs> Destination period, I get it. If I had it my way, I'd be at art school for the summer with my friends. My grand just had to throw me in her grand eyes when she asked me to paint this mural. Mural. I couldn't say no. Grands. Grands indeed. Oh. Okay, not a hundred. Since I remember when it still used to be fun, like 20 years ago. What made the festival fun back then? Oh, I don't know. I was a kid, so everything just felt more magical. Farmers came to show off their best crops. Artisans sold all sorts of goods. First time I asked someone out was to go on a date to the festival. Aww. They said no, and that festival was lame. Aww. I mean, obviously. Not the fantastic artist I am today. I want to meet Dork Manisha. Definitely still a dork. Nothing wrong with dorks, though. People moved away, and now that I'm older, I guess I see the work it takes to put on. And it's like, for what? The expectations seem so high this year because you're here. Oh, yikes. 
Everyone assumes that means we're going to be a massive success. Oh. Not my fault. Oh. Uh-oh. I've kept the carbon pilot in part to myself for now, but I don't... But don't think I don't have my eye on you. What did we do? Oh, of course, because of the writing and pretending to be gone. Okay. I see. Pressure! Drinking this potion better material better materialize this mural out of thin air. <laughs> wow. Are we being nagged? If you just want to get it done, couldn't you just throw a paint on the wall? That's like modern or whatever, right? The ground doesn't seem very wrathful. I definitely see how Ruth can be wrathful. Wrathful Ruth, that's what they called her. Hi, oh, nice. Oh my god, I'm like already melting. All things people say when they hate what you've shown them but are trying to be kind about it. Alright. My gran doesn't hate me. Maybe. She's just, um, currently a little disappointed. Wow. Everyone's got issues. Family issues. Okay. Good luck. Well. So we've done these guys. I guess let's check in on... Let's have a door shut in our face again. Can't possibly go worse than it did yesterday. Yes, quite. But I don't like Gene, so I doubt it. Doesn't seem like he's trying to burn the place down today. That's good. Uh-oh. Ah! Mm-hmm. Oh. We're allowed in this time? Give me cake! Give me cake! Yay! Mm-hmm. <gasps> Fuck yes. Oh my god. Okay. Now I'm desperate. Desperate for some cheesecake! <laughs> Jane's trying to apologize, Tassels. Um. <laughs> okay. No. Okay. Hmm. No. Oh. Yes. What? I thought Madeline's were biscuits. Biscuity cake? Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> Man of many words. All right, well, at least we got some cheesecake out of it. Yeah, so you're up on things today. Ta-da, oh. A feeling? A purple feeling. Ooh. <laughs> Yikes. Yeah. What does this mean? What does it mean? What does it all mean? Where, where, what's our, what, let's just check in on our donations because we've got five minutes left. Five minutes left of the stream, but that was incredible. I cannot believe we hit our target so easily. Pretty amazing. Pretty, pretty great. 107. Uh, 107 percent. That is amazing. We're currently on 5,356 pounds raised for charity. That is amazing. Um, thank you all so, so much. Um, Thank you, Lloyd Maeve. Thank you, JD. Thank you, Beth. Andy Meany. Um, Anonymous. Wow. Just lovely positive vibes all around. Um, and everyone is, uh, is <laughs> talking about Madelines and what exactly they are. Um, yes, they are small spongy cakes. Uh, soft and fluffy with a cake texture, but the size of biscuits, says Lloyd Maeve. Mmm. Um, that is, they do sound quite delicious. 
Um, hello everyone who's just joining us. Yes, I am back. I'm back. Couldn't keep me away for that long. Um, thank you, Nightcat, uh, for the uh, the link to mermaids as well. If you want to find out a bit more about what mermaids do, um, uh, a little like spike says John Fricker. Why not? A little like spike if you feel like it. That's nice. Um, <laughs> Jean, you look a lot like me, says Commander Vimes, right down to the bags under your eyes. I mean, let they who are without bags cast the first bag. Um, let's give, let's give Dawn, let's, because we only have four minutes left, so let's give Mel her, her potion. Uh, hello? Mel? I have your overcome charm. <laughs> Rude, nice hands, and overcome come charm. Yes, rosemary, calendula, and do I send some geranium? <gasps> How did you know? She's a grippy. Oh, right. Hmm. Have their morning go get a ritual. Have you tried it? Uh, no. Oh, no. Hopefully, Mel won't have tried the, the fake spells that we put in. Do you do big rituals? Um. You see, I recently tried a ritual. Oh no! But I'm sure it was me and not the ritual. I'm sure the editors at Cotton Politan are very strict about the content in their publication. Anyways, this ritual. Well, it's a little embarrassing, to be honest, because it required the purchase of a jail. Oh no! Mel, I'm so sorry. Oh no. <gasps> Doesn't matter. Didn't do much, but Jean had to. Oh no! It all went wrong with the jade egg, Mel. I'm sorry. That's... Uh... Total funny. Ha! Know them! We're our tribals! <gasps> no! <laughs> so, what's the big task you have today? Oh, it's a doozy, alright! And of course, they charge you ten times more any, ten times more any time you need a supplier at the last minute. That is true, but people need to relieve themselves, and we can't have that happening in the bushes. I thought they were talking. She was talking about jade eggs again for a second. The portable toilets, yes. And I figured this fell could help me with portable toilets. <sighs> I don't think this charm will help you find toilets. I know where to find toilets. It's about getting those who have toilets to take me seriously and give me the toilets. It's a whole toilet thing. Hooray! Oh god. This town's under a lot of pressure. That's what I just said, tassels. The fate of Flora is in my hands! Is this the first festival you- No, I've helped organize the Floralia Festival for the past five years or so. But this year just feels different. The mayor has stepped aside whether or not she'll admit it. Oh, our chief builder has injured himself, so now we have to rely on my goofball brother. Something is going on. There's a deeper thing at work here. Why a new builder? Why the mayor obviously possessed or something? And even though I'm super excited to have a real witch in town, I can't help but feel like successful or not, this festival is going to be the beginning of a new life. Hmm... Maybe I shouldn't have told you all of that. But there's no time to get down about that. I need to get those toilets, then figure out what the prize is for the pickle eating contest. I, f I would fancy my chances in a pickle eating contest, actually. And after that, we still need to put together the performance schedule. I wonder how Devin's composition. Don't ask about Devin, they're fine. No, leave them alone. Logistics! Ah! But everything fine, because we have magic! That's right. Yes! Positivity! Pressure! Ah! Uh, yeah. uh. Inspiring! Hooray! Go talk to the toilets! Goodbye. Farewell. Farewell, Mel. Right, well, it is five o'clock. Um, so, that's probably a good place to leave it. Even though we didn't- we made some spells, you know? We made one friend, singular. We met some people. We're at 109% of our target, which is incredible. 
Um, thank you so much to the last minute uh, donations from Minna H and uh, Sam Foster. Thank you so, so much. Um, and thank you to everyone, you know, who, who just came, stopped by to hang out in the chat. It is so much appreciated. Um, you know, like, like I said before, this stream is really just about spreading a little bit of positivity today and sending a little bit of love um, to a community that I think really um, deserves and needs a little bit of it today, especially for no particular reason. Um, but it's been lovely. It's been lovely to hang out with you all again. Uh, it's been lovely to stream again. Um, and the, the, there's plenty more where that came from. I am going to leave the stream um, or the donation link open if you feel like donating later. Entirely up to you. Um, you know, if you're watching on VOD, it's still there. If you feel like, feel like dropping whatever you have, whatever you're comfortable donating. Um, trans rights are human rights, guys. Um, that's that's just them's just the facts. Um, so lots of love to everyone. Thank you all so so much. And we'll see you very soon. We've got lots more exciting stuff coming up on the channel. I don't know what, because I'm still recovering. Um, but, you know, stay tuned. There'll be lots more. And goodbye. Bye.